All right, and a warning tonight. Police are searching for a group of violent robbers who shot and killed a teenager in Springdale. Thank you for joining us. I'm Tamika Artis. New at five witnesses opened up to nine on your sides. Courtney Francisco. She is live now outside of police headquarters in Courtney. They fear these criminals are targeting them specifically, correct? Yeah, you know, a lot of folks at this apartment complex are Central American, and I had to use Spanish with almost everyone I spoke with today. So they point out there could be a language barrier there if a robber demands money, or there is a complex trust issue with police, so maybe robbers think they won't call police for help, and so they are feeling very vulnerable tonight. A family attacked outside their home. Now neighbors fear they could be next. I'm scared too. My family too, my child. They don't want to stay no more here. It was 8.30 last night at the Willows at Springdale Apartments. Rolando Escalante tells me his neighbor, Josue Ramirez, and his mom had just pulled into the parking lot when police say a group of three or four men jumped out to rob them. It's very horrible yesterday. Escalante heard a gunshot and saw the mother holding her son's body. He died in the hospital, 18 years old. Too young, too young. Around here, most people are Guatemalan, and they had to speak to me in Spanish. Él es muy you know Spanish. So. They fear criminals target them, thinking they're vulnerable, or that they won't call police in fear of deportation. They follow to Spanish people because, you know, the Spanish people, they like work, they have money or something. The assistant police chief says complexes have their problems. Like any apartment complex, it has a variety of issues, but uh, I would I would actually say it's a fairly safe place overall. Escalante says two robbers attacked him here in July, and with this latest want killing, no he wants here. to get his family out. I don't like it, this place, you know. And I want to be clear, police say they never check citizenship when they go out on these calls, so do not be afraid to call for help. Now, they are looking for these three to four men, but they do not have a good description of them. So if you can help, you can call Crime Stoppers at 513-352-3040. A reward is available, so keep that in mind. Live in Springdale, Courtney Francisco, Lat 9 on your side.